Cheryl the Craftnut32 and I am here with another Silhouette Sunday. This time I'm here sharing this really cute little barn card. I love it because here's the barn, you open it up and there's a little cow that says Moo. So this card was really fun to make. It took a lot longer on my Silhouette than I anticipated so I kind of thought instead of going through all of the steps while I was making it, I would just share the finished product. Um, this is a barn I bought from the Silhouette Studio. I love all the little details with it. I sized the actual barn so it would fit in a A2 size envelope. What I did, um, instead of cutting out all the layers to layer on top of the card once it was done, it had this rectangular box. Um, so I took it, I centered it on the barn itself, and then I just um, subtracted the cut lines for the side. And that's how I made the swing doors for the front of the barn. The second rectangle here and the X that kind of cross the barn doors. I just put a cut line right down the middle so I could adhere them to the barn doors itself and they would also swing. So it was pretty straightforward, just kind of a little time consuming and tedious to make sure that everything lined up and that it was straight. So uh, really straightforward though, if you wanted to replicate it, it would be really easy for you to do so also. I sized everything all at the same time so it would be proportional. I used my Tombow multi-liquid glue to adhere everything down and I've not really, I've had a love-hate relationship. I've had this glue for a really long time um, and I started using it recently and I'm beginning to really like it so um, it was easy to use. For the burn itself, I wanted to give it some details so I grabbed my, my favorite things, wood grain background stamp set and some Simon Says Stamp Schoolhouse Red and then I stamped that barn to kind of give it like a nice look there and otherwise it was just putting it all together and the inside is really cute the font for the Moo I just again used a speech bubble from the Silhouette store the font for the Moo is I can tell you in one second oak burn font and I thought that was perfect. I love the detail with the font also, the little M and the O's. Um, and this cow here is called Chubby Cow and he is also from the Silhouette store. What I did for him is I cut him out in black and white but I wanted the eyes to kind of have some distinction and I don't know, even though he's not really realistic looking, I wanted him to have kind of some nice coloring so I distressed him with some antique linen distress ink and I really love how that turned out a nice darker edge and the nice white center I replicated the hay up top for down below just so he's sitting on some hay and I put some um, brown, I can't think of the word I'm thinking of um, craft cardstock <laughs> behind it so it looks like he's in a burn so this whole front panel here is popped up and what I did for to create the card is I just used this front barn. I um, mirrored it so it created a second one. I put it together and I grouped it. And then I just cut the cut line that would have gone down the center. And I used my eraser tool and I just took it away, clicked on it, and then I deleted it. So I have created the base of my card also. So. Um, like I said, really easy to create, just kind of time sensitive because you want to make sure everything was centered and straight, um, drawing lines. I don't know if everyone has that problem, but every once in a while I'll draw a line and I'm not sure if it's straight. So I just took my time and made sure everything was. And then I had lots of starts and stops also. So um, we're sending this off to my niece. She was with us for the week and we're just going to send her a little note saying how much we enjoyed her company. And I thought something kind of fun and different. I wanted to do something different. Normally I do like a scene card with hills. And then I thought even to have the barn off on a hill and then a speech bubble. And I thought once I saw the barn, why not have the doors open? And that's how this card, that's how I thought of this card anyway. Um, I hope everyone's having a great Sunday and a great week. I'll talk with you later. Bye.